Joining us now to review some of the headlines of today's newspapers from around the world is Arise News Analyst Emmanuel Efeni. Good morning, Emmanuel. Good morning, Ruben. Good morning, Rufai. Good morning, Good morning Victoria Tundu MQ Abiola. Good morning. Yes. Uh, well, it's a day of morning in the UK and all around the world. And the newspapers in Nigeria and all around the world just reflecting that. The, this is the Nigeria's newspaper of record, of course. The lead story there, the queen is dead. Age 96, Buhari, world leader, pay tributes to queen of all seasons. And above the masthead, the window story, we'll call it, long live King Charles III. New monarchies, the death of queen, moment of greatest sadness for him and family. Now, other newspapers are also reporting this story. The Guardian newspaper, yes, the Guardian newspaper also has that story. The queen dies, long live the king, while the Punch newspaper, Queen Elizabeth's death at 96. World leaders pay tributes, Britain mourns, Charles becomes king. While, uh, of course, uh, there are other stories in the newspaper. Yes, the Daily Trust also has that story at its lead. Queen Elizabeth II, 1926 to 2022, Buhari world leaders pay tributes, life and times of longest serving monarch. Her ties with Nigeria, how King Charles will be unveiled. But, of course, there are other stories of the day. The Vanguard newspaper, PDP crisis, Governor Wiki kicks as Ayu survives, says Jibrim res resignations of no effect, reveals what Ayu Atiku told him over state of party. BOT chair Jibrim out Mwabara in. Let's resolve our problems internally, Atiku begs aggrieved members. NEC approved campaign structure, focus on grassroots mobilization, mom on membership, on membership, leadership. Now, the nation newspaper, also the PDP crisis. Are you Jibrin not? No, are you not Jibrin should resign? Says Wiki. PDP neck passes vote of confidence on chairman. I resign in party interest, says BOT chair. Wabara replaces Jibrin. I thought with uh, that uh, resignation of Jibrin as BOT chair, perhaps. Wiki will be assuaged, but Wiki says no. BOT is just an advisory body of the party, and he remains unplacated, as it were, because he was saying, "What is the need for uh, Uguain? Uguain? Uguain is the governor of Enugu State, and what is it? What is the need for Ikpeazu? Ikpeazu, the governor of Abia State." And Wabara is from Abia State, but we can say, no, not yet. Ayu must go for there to be peace. Well, we'll see how it will. The foreign newspapers, of course, no prize for guessing what is on the front page of all British newspapers. The Times of London, a life of service. Of course, the Queen, Queen Elizabeth, uh, adorning the front page. The Daily Telegraph. Grief is the price we pay for love. People like Tundu, we pay that. Yes, <laughs> because we love the queen. I do. Yes, so grief is the price you pay. Daily Mail, our hearts are broken. How to find words. The New York Times, the New York Times, yes. Queen and spirit of Britain. Yes, Queen Elizabeth II, who served uh, Seven decades linked generations died at 96. A country in turmoil enters a period of mourning and transition. Yes, transition at the political level, transition at the royal level. Well, what can I say? The queen is gone, but um, of course, we remember the decolonization of Africa under her Majesty, and um, of course, Brit Great Britain shrinking became simply Britain. Not so great after all. 
the sun sets on the British yes. Empire, didn't it? <laughs> Wow. Yes, and we cannot forget, of course, how she was shaped by the Second World War. Uh, the princess mechanic, she was called then, a colonel in the British Army, helped to shape her for the job that was ahead well, as queen. Know, during the Second World War, there was advice that she should relocate to Canada. Yeah. Uh, but she refused to relocate to Canada. She decided to stay in her country, and she joined uh, the military to and be part of. as a mechanic. The yes. first member yes. of the royal family, actually. So. Mm -hmm. Anyway, if any, not more time, but looking at the reportage, many of the papers did very well locally here. True. Uh, this day has an excellent... Uh, no, the, of know, course, the newspaper press uh, coverage. But I, I, the papers I checked, not one editorial board managed to do an editorial today. You know, that's not a standard. Uh, you know, uh, the, yeah. the, the basic standard it's is... What you, you, you sit down, convene an emergency editorial board, <laughs> and in these days of technology, no, no you can do that immediately. No and you knock something together, Ruben. Well, I mean, no. <laughs> there was enough time. Yes, but enough time to Most do of that. the editorial boards uh, in Nigeria dropped the ball, but that's it.